Hey everyone, Jordy here from Cinecam.net and recently I've published a point of view short film called Routine in collaboration with Adobe. 47 shots in total for a 3 minute film, so organization while editing was very important. And that's why I used the new freeform view inside Adobe Premiere Pro, which I'd like to share some practical examples from. So on the bottom of your project window, you'll find a button called Freeform View. And this will allow you to move around and arrange your clips, which will be very useful to prepare for an edit. Now, if you double click on the project panel, it will maximize so that you've got an entire screen to work with. And because I had multiple takes for each shot, I had to make a choice. Therefore, I would group the takes and order them. My favorite pick sits on top. Now, shots that I believe should be shot again got a red label, which you can set from your right click menu. You can also change the size of a clip if you like to distinct them from the rest. So basically I did a sort of post storyboarding like this. Because it was very easy for me to reshoot, I didn't pay much attention in pre-production. I mostly wanted to see my shot and see how it would look next to the other clips. Now clips that I knew were not good got hide it. Simply right click on the desired clip and choose hide. You can also use the short key Ctrl H or for the Mac users Command H. When you hold down your Alt key and then scroll, you can zoom in and out, giving you a quick overview. And by taking the hand tool or pressing H, you can move around the freeform view. And once I've arranged everything and the video is starting to take shape, I start by dragging my favorite takes into the timeline. I would leave a gap in the timeline for the shots that I needed to reshoot. And that is how I used the freeform view and how it helped me a lot during the edit of my short film. Thank you so much for watching. You can check out more tutorials by clicking the playlist from the description below.